Back Chinese New Year's is this Saturday, and it will be the year of the rat. If you would like to receive some good fortune for the new year, we have someone very special that you should see. Joining us in studio, we have Ina Chang, a Chinese calligrapher. Thank you so much for being with us. My pleasure. First of all, tell us a little bit about yourself. How did you get into calligraphy? Well, I was born and raised in Taiwan, and I started、uh, chi learning Chinese calligraphy when I was eight years old. Wow. And so I've been practicing ever since. So I've been under、um, directions by two different masters. From age eight until twenty, until I came to the United States. And it's such a beautiful art form too to see all the strokes. I love it. <laughs> okay, so tell us about the importance of calligraphy during Chinese New Year's. Well,、um, people always like the color red during Chinese New Year, so they want to have、um, the well. Red signifies good luck and fortune,、mm -hmm. so they want to hang on the two sides of the doors. And so,、um, and then also we have good fortune words written on the red paper. So it really means, you know, it's the beginning of the new year. We want good fortune. And that that would be these two right here. Yes. Okay. Let's let's see your work. Sure. I want to see some、sure. something. So what are you going to write for us today? Okay. I heard that you're getting married. I am. So I'm going <laughs> to write a, a good fortune、um, for you. Okay. So that means that.、Um, Uh, what is that? I think I picked the one something about a match made in heaven. Right, right. Being so, a good match. Right. <laughs>、okay. So let me let me write that for you. Okay. It, is, did it take you a long time to master the art of calligraphy? Well, without disclosing my real age, <laughs> I did start when I was eight years old, and、um, I've been practicing over thirty years. Wow. It's so beautiful to watch how almost it's like, almost relaxing. It looks like. Yes, it is. Okay. So, how many characters are you writing for this one? I'm writing four characters. Four characters. And can you talk a little bit about what the saying is in Chinese? Okay. It means、um, this word I'm writing. It means、uh, heaven. 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 Okay. And what about this one? This one means、um, destiny. It's so beautiful, just watching your strokes. Thank you. Do you have to concentrate doing this, or does it come pretty naturally to you now? Pretty naturally. How do you say this phrase in Chinese? 天缘巧合。天缘巧合。巧合。Very good. Okay. Very good. Very good. There you go. So beautiful. That's it. That's it. That's it. And then, what was the translation again? Oh, that means、um, does, that means heaven. Okay.、Um, well, destiny, and it's a perfect match. Okay.、Literally. So like a match made in heaven. Right. Oh, it's so beautiful. I'm gonna pick this up and show everyone. So this, what would you do with it now once people get this? So this one, I would recommend hanging it on、um, what、well, in your living room. Okay.、Um, so you can see it every day, and then it's a reminder of you know you and your marriage, your your partner. And and then you know also a good fortune for the rest of the year. So I'm gonna keep this up in my living room. You、yes. said to keep this up the whole year. For the whole year. Okay. Yes. And then now we also have one other thing that you're gonna show us. Yes. What are what are these ones? Okay. So this is a. Should I show audience what? Sure. Okay. Go ahead. So、um, this is what I'm going to write.、Um, this word is in fact upside down.、Um, it. Well, I'm gonna show you the right, the word that is supposed to be this way. It means good luck, and the reason why we are hanging upside down because、um, the Chinese word for、um, arrived, okay, is the same pronunciation as upside down. Ah. So the good luck has arrived. I see. Okay. And what's、That's、the word、I'm, in Chinese?、Uh, good luck, fortune, um, fu. Okay, fu. So fu has arrived. So you hang this upside down for the whole year as well. For the whole year as well. Okay. Beautiful. Can you write one more thing? One、sure. more time. You're gonna write this one, right? I'm gonna write this one. Fu. It's so beautiful to watch. Now I will say I took Chinese classes in high school and college. Took a couple of calligraphy classes. Mine was not this beautiful as hers. And this one's fu, you said, and that means good luck. Yes. And then we do it in one stroke. One stroke, you said. Yes. So you're, you're not supposed to lift your pen. Well, in the style. I see,、mm -hmm. and then you hang that upside down. Correct. Very beautiful. So now, if anyone watching wants to get some of these good luck calligraphy、yes. for the year, how can they find you? Are you going to be around town? Yes. In fact, the Chinese New Year is this coming week. I will be in Alamoana Shopping Center,、um, 
Royal Hawaiian Shopping Center, uh, Louis Vuitton, Waikiki. Ooh, okay. And also uh, Kahala Mall on February 1st. And um, February 8th, I will be in Coco Marina Shopping Center. And people can pick out a phrase or saying that they want, and they can hang this up for the year for themselves. Yes. And it's free. It's free. It's free for the public. Thank you so much for of course, joining us. My pleasure. I'm going to keep this one. And to everyone out there, Shinyan Kwai Le. Shinyan Kwai Le. Bridget, back to you. Whew. Wish I was that talented, huh? Those are beautiful. <laughs> Anything artistic, I am so bad not, at. So whenever, I'm not good at that either. Whenever I see someone that can do it, yeah. I'm, I'm impressed. We need to get some lessons. Yes. Thanks, guys. <laughs>